Hi, it's Janie. Welcome back to my channel. And today I have a huge, huge, ginormous Ulta haul. <laughs> Look at this. I got the big bag. Um, I didn't purchase all this at one time in the store. Most of this was online orders. And the only reason why I have this big bag is because I went in last night to get my granddaughter her birthday present and she was wanting a little um, makeup train case so I got her a little caboodle that's why I got the big bag anyway I have a lot of stuff though um, a lot so this is going to be a long video and I'm not going to do a whole lot of extra introductions here or talking so we're just going to get started with what I've got in this bag so I'm going to kind of take some stuff out and I'll be right back okay I am back and I have a lot of things that I purchased during the Ulta 21 days of beauty and um, some of these products are some of the specials that they had during the 21 days of beauty and then some of this is separate from that that I ordered when my daughter placed an order because she had a 20% off coupon. So um, I will save those items last, maybe, if I can remember what they were. And um, I will just kind of show you what I got. And I got a lot. And I know the Sephora VIB sale is getting ready to come up. I think it starts next weekend. That's 15% off. I don't foresee me purchasing anything from that. I think there's maybe one um, under eye eye serum that I'm looking at that I may purchase. But other than that, I did the bulk of my um, sale purchases with Ulta because um, I really like Ulta's um, reward point system better than Sephora. So... And these were some really good deals. A lot of these things were ha were 50% off. And I mean, that's a whole lot better than a 20% off. Anyway, so I'm trying to justify myself to you guys because once you see everything, uh, yeah, I need some justification. All right. Um, I don't know what was what for each day. So I'm just going to start grabbing. So I did get a um, Better Than Sex Mascara. This was 50% off. So it ran it around $11 and something. Um wanted to give it a try and that $11 mark kind of almost makes it drugstore pricing so I got that start tossing things back into my bag there um, I got the Shiseido um, sunscreen this is the SPF 42 urban environment oil free UV protector broad spec spectrum it's water resistant for 40 minutes I don't plan on being any water out in the sun but um, I know I'm almost out of my Misha sunscreen, so I wanted to try this. It was a 50, I'm pretty sure it was 50% off, so I got one of those. The Lorac um, eyeshadow palette, this one I know was half off. I think this was the very first day. This is the Pro Palette number three, and I didn't have it, so at 50% off, you can't beat that price. And if you haven't seen it, I've used it a few times. That is what it looks like there. I'm not going to do any swatches, I don't think, because I just have so much to show you. But if there's something um, that I show that you would like a more in-depth review on, I could always do that if you would let me know. And then I did get a couple of the Smashbox primer waters um, to try. They were half off and I got one for myself and one for my daughter. So that's why I got two of those. That's why some of this stuff I did get um, doubles on. The Becca um, high, um, primers, I got the backlit priming filter and the first light priming filter. This one's the lavender one and I had just received a bottle. Um, for, through Octoly and I really do like this and so I ordered one of these for my daughter to let her try it and see how she likes it because I do still have almost a full bottle that I received through Octoly and then um, I got this from Laura Geller and this is the Spackle Treatment Makeup Primer and it's supposed to be hydrating 
I've been wanting to try the Spackle line of primers and they've been around for a long time. I just have never taken the time to purchase. So well, I will see how that works out for me. And I will let you know on that one. So I did get that. I know I'm, I'm going kind of fast through this stuff, but I there's a lot. And then um, the Persona eyeshadow palette. This one is specifically for brown eyes. Obviously, I don't have brown eyes, but it was really pretty. It had a lot of good reviews, and it was half off, so I got it. It's the Persona Identity Palette, and this is what I created my eye look with today. I've worn it several times, and it is a very pretty um, eyeshadow palette. Looks like that there. And there are the colors there. Definitely fall colors, fall winter colors. Um, but here in Oklahoma, today is April the 8th. Yesterday, April the 7th, we woke up and had snow on the ground. Yeah, snow in April in Oklahoma. I don't know if we set a record or not. I never, ever have remembered it snowing in April. February maybe, but never March or April. But anyway, it didn't last. Um, by the time we went home in the evening time, it had got up to like 58 degrees and had all melted, but still snow. And it was enough snow that it, you know, had a pretty good dusting on the ground. So anyway, I don't, I don't know what to think of that. I don't know if, like I said, I don't know if we set any records or not, but sure seemed like it. Then from It Cosmetics, I got one of the blushes, the Confidence in You Glow Blush blushes, and this one I got in, um, oh, which one, what color is this one? I don't see it. But it's got a, a highlighting, a blush, and a bronzer in it. It's like a great gradu graduated gradient <laughs> um, there you see it's got your highlight whoops that's your highlight your blush and then your bronzer and then you can do each one separately or you can do them together um, I did get the brush that is specifically designed for this that supposedly you're supposed to be able to sweep it across and then do it into onto your cheeks and then it puts you know each one of these colors in the right position on your cheek um i did not feel like it did that i liked the brush and everything but by the time it was all said and done it just looked like i had a big section of blush right there so mm, it wasn't too crazy about the brush but i did get both of those were they half off? Yeah, they were half off each. And that um, brush is called the Heavenly Skin One Sweep Wonder Brush is what it is called. And then back to Laura Geller. Um, there was one day they had their her blushes on sale. And it's the Baked Blush and Brighten. And I got it in two colors. I got one in Tropic Hues and the other one in Honeysuckle. This one is Tropic Hues. If I get that open. And then this one is in Honeysuckle. I really wanted the one that was called Apricot. But by the time I got ready to place my order, Apricot was sold out. And it was online only item so but there's those two colors very pretty i've worn both of them and just made very pretty look on the cheeks dose of colors now these were not um the next items wait let me hang on let me back up let me back up there was another item that was a 21 days of beauty product and this is the um Butter London, the Glazen Eye Gloss, and this is in the color Frosted. Yeah, Frosted. I wanted to try these. It's like a little a liquid eyeshadow. It almost looks like, um, like, oh, what 
do I want to say this looks like? Um, yogurt, like a texture of yogurt. It's real moussey almost, but there's that color. I'll go ahead and swatch that. I had ordered another one called um, Unicorn, but that one I'm sending back because it was nothing but glitter, an iridescent glitter, and I, I didn't care for that. So I did get one of those when they were doing that on that day. And one thing that I did, I never realized during the 21 Days of Beauty, I've never actually have participated in the 21 Days of Beauty because a um, couple of reasons. One being that I didn't realize that if you were platinum, if you ordered one of those items on the 21 Days of Beauty, you got free shipping on that item or on your order, regardless of how much you ordered. You know, it can be just that one thing. So I've never placed an order in the past because I didn't want to pay the shipping to just get one item. And then second, you know, before I didn't have an Ulta that was close to me, it was like 45 minutes, if not an hour to get to one. Now I have one that is just um, like maybe six blocks away, 10 blocks, maybe 10 blocks. It's not very far anyway, but I didn't actually go into store to get anything. I did everything online and that is why because I was able to get free shipping on even if I just placed an order for one thing anyway now the next items I have were um, part of the 21 days of beauty but they were just um, a reduction in price and they were going on through the whole entire 21 days of beauty one being this um, spray from Tarte. It's the Ready Set Radiant Skin Mist and I do believe this was like 40% off. Wanted to give it a try. And then the two um, Dose of Color eyeshadows with the glitter um, pots here I ordered and what are they called? Here's the little packaging for them. They're really cute. It's the Ideal Duo. It's a loose pigment and primer. And I got them in two, two colors, one being shell. And that is what the color shell looks like. Almost probably looks similar to this Better London eyeshadow that I just showed you. Pretty, pretty similar, huh? And then um, you have the loose pigment down here. And it definitely has a lot of um, glitter in it. But then you just put that on top of that cream. And now it really looks identical to that Better London one, doesn't it? Hmm. I may need to rethink on whether or not I want to keep that Better London one then. Since that looks identical. It does. It looks identical. So I probably will send that Better London one back. And then the other dose of color one that I got, this one is called Lemon Drop. And this is so pretty. Um, it's not going to be everyone's cup of tea because it is, it's yellow. But it is so pretty. Man. And of course I don't have anything yellow, too many yellow things. Right there. And then the pigment is really pretty. I wish I could show you, but I'm afraid I will um, spill it. But let's put that on there. Oh, I hope you can see that, how pretty that is. I had it on in my empties video, I do believe. I had this on as part of my eye look. And then the last thing that I got during, for the 21 Days of Beauty was a Mario Badesco set. This is their um, sp face sprays and all the different um, combinations that they do. They do one that is aloe, cucumber, and green tea. Then they do the one that has the aloe, um, rose water, and, and herbs. And then the other one that's aloe, chamomile, and lavender. And these were 25% off this kit. This kit was like $15. And then my non um, 21 Days of Beauty that I ordered, but I did get 20% uh, off, 
on was um, I got another gel of my gel that I use. It's the Wee Dad Curl Quencher Moisturizing Styling Gel. I normally bit order the big liter size off of the Wee Dad website, but I missed the sale on those. So um, I'll have to wait until they do the 20% off sale on those again, but I just got one of these to get me by until then. Got a Lash Duo Glue, and this is the one that is in clear, transparent. A little baby um, blush. This is the Gold Rush from Benef Benefit, and it's the newest um, color that they just came out of, came out with. And I just wanted to get the smaller size of it. And to be honest with you, first of all, it smells really good. It has a really good scent, but um, it just doesn't have a whole lot of payoff to it. I have it on. I mean, I don't know if you're really going to be able to tell. It's just out of all of the ones that I have have of the benefit of the little box blushes, this is probably the one that has that is the lightest. It just doesn't have. It's just not very pigmented and but it's right there so anyway I think if you were much darker than I am you it wouldn't show up at all so it's definitely something that's going to be for fair-skinned folks and the bigger one could actually be a different color because I know the last one that they did the um what is it the California California girl I don't forget what it's called but it's the last one that they did when they did the full sized one in the mini they were two different colors even though they were supposed to be the same thing so that could be the case with that so check out both and I like I said I ordered that online so I don't know if the bigger one is has more color payoff I don't know then I got this little mask here. This is the Baby Foot Original Exfoliant Foot Bill. I'm going to do that probably tomorrow night. And then I got the Too Faced Bonbons um, Chocolate Bonbon Eyeshadow Palette. I have been wanting this, and while it was 20% off, I thought I would go ahead and get it. So, while I was spending money, why not? So, very pretty. Of course, it smells like chocolate. Mm smells so good so wow okay that is it I got that done in about probably 20 minutes because like I said I just kind of went shoom, right through it so if there's anything that you have seen that you want me to do a more in-depth review of I would be more than happy to do that just let me know in the comments below and thank you so much for joining me today I hope that you have enjoyed and also let us know in the comments what you are planning to get at the Sephora um, spring sale that's getting ready to come up. Or let us know what you got during the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty. Now they're doing some other kind of sale too for the next two weeks. So I, I kind of looked at it. There wasn't anything I seen that I needed or wanted. Thank goodness because I've got a little, got, I got a lot of stuff to put away here. But anyway, thank you so much for joining. Don't forget to subscribe and to click on the little bell icon and give me a thumbs up and I'll talk to you soon.